What's good everybody, it's your boy Natty and I'm back in the video channel guys, I hope you guys are doing good because I am great guys um, It's been a while since I've uploaded, mind me guys, uni is not easy, it's taking my time And there's some big plans that I'm working on in the background and that's one of the reasons why I'm making this video Because I want to make an announcement and basically let you know where I'm going to be at for a car event Yeah, it's a car event, this coming weekend so I was like, now nah, I gotta get this video to you guys right now And also I uh, just a few things I want to discuss with you guys uh, in this video and let you guys know about my business and today's sponsor. In fact, not just today's sponsor, the the, the business and sponsoring this whole channel from the beginning, guys. We'll get more into it in just a second, guys. If you guys haven't already, guys, make sure to subscribe to the channel, guys. Turn the notification bell on. That way, you guys are informed every time I upload a video or a reel. The main reason why I'm making this video now is because this coming weekend, the 27th of August, I will be at Bragging Rides at the drag event at the Red Star Raceway. If you guys know about it, if you guys follow any of the uh, uh, you know, the car scene, if you guys follow Underground Sight, which is one of the crews I'm in, uh, they're having a drag event uh, this coming weekend, but I'm not racing my car. You guys saw the previous video, link right here. The engine of the car is not running the base. I'm not racing, but I will be there with my business, guys, which is something I'm gonna speak about uh, just in a second, and there, today's a, a video sponsor, guys. But if you guys look uh, at my channel at the beginning, you guys will notice that I did a lot well, basically only single content uh, uh, back in the day and I actually did a video recently but obviously since I got my car I've transitioned more into automotive car content uh, and the reason why there was sneaker stars is because guys guys I'm a reseller if you guys do not know uh, now you know but it's been obvious if you guys ever look at my channel in the background you guys look over there I've got sneakers there if you guys look on my uh, 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 Instagram moist posting sneakers if you guys look on the YouTube uh, banner there's my my the link to my business uh, page if you look in the description it's always been there guys so uh, with that guys today's video is sponsored by Soul Reserve guys uh, this is the logo right here Soul Reserve is a business that me and my friend Jared started in 2020 uh, where we resell authentic sneakers at, for, at fair market value uh, you know things like Jordans, Nikes, Dunks, Yeezys, you know Adidas, New Balances uh, sometimes apparel, you know, essentials, uh, babe, supreme, yeah, all that kind of stuff, guys. So, uh, so Reserve is a, is a sponsor for today's video. Basically, so Reserve is an online based uh, a business uh, that me and my friend run where we sell shoes online and obviously get them delivered to you guys nationwide. Uh, and the main thing about the our page is that everything is obviously authentic. First thing, secondly, the, the prices are fair market value, they're they not, you know, super expensive. And uh, that business has been sponsoring. Uh, not just you know, the video, they've been sponsoring basically everything. That's the business, that's my side business that I have. Uh, as you guys know, I'm a vid student, which is the main thing I do, and then obviously racing and then uh, YouTube. But yeah, the money that I make, uh, what I used to have to afford these uh, car models you guys see on the channel, and other various things that I have, you know, for racing and you know, personal life stuff is all funded through Soul Reserve, my business guys. And I want you guys know about Soul Reserve for two reasons, because the event this weekend at Bragging Rides, I'm gonna have Soul Reserve there as a stand. So uh, if you guys are gonna be there, I'm gonna be there with my GTI. Uh, and, and obviously, if you guys want to support uh, to the business, uh, you guys can come through on that day or obviously just the link down below to buy shoes online and browse. So on top of that also is, uh, a lot of you guys have been asking me how do I afford uh, these mods. So, also wanted to give you guys an idea for those people who are saying I'm just buy this and this and this, you know. Uh, all these mods are self-funded by me and by me selling shoes. So sometimes, you know, certain things are a little bit easy to buy and some other things are not. So yeah, the cheaper stuff, uh, it's easy to, you know, it's easier to make the money. But you know, trying to spend 20,000 rand, 10,000 rand on just one part is quite, uh, uh, you know, pocket damaging. So I want you guys to understand, you know, why some things take time is because I have to sell, I don't know how many shoes to make that kind of money uh, for me to upgrade the cars. That's why the the the, pro, the progress of the chan of the car won't be as fast as you guys would have liked. It's because I don't have, you know, some sort of like secret money glitch somewhere or got money lying in the bank. It's because I have to actively work for it and sell shoes. Um, another big reason I'm making this video now is because I always promised myself that when I get to thousand subscribers. I would do this new collection video because also keeping in mind back in the day I was doing sneaker videos all the time. I said to myself when I get to a thousand subscribers I'm gonna do a sneaker collection video 
but you guys have been killing the game by subscribing guys and sharing and I see it guys uh, even the comments guys they help the YouTube algorithm so much so thanks to you guys we went from like what I don't know 400 500 subscribers and now, now we're like 2.5 about to get 2.6 uh, uh, thousand subscribers all thanks to you guys so I'm like you know what uh, this is a perfect time to uh, let you guys know about the business that I have so reserved guys and as well as do a sneaker collection video so that's what we're gonna do in this video guys if you guys do want to support and you guys are looking for some sneakers make sure to support the business so reserve guys link down below in the description you guys can go browse and just for the people watching this channel guys i'm gonna give you guys a discount code yes guys this is for the first time a sponsored video because i'm sponsoring the video basically you guys are uh, anyone that uses the discount Nati28 uh, and at checkout on the source of uh, website will get 10% off of your entire order on the source of website. With that, guys, let's get uh, into the sneaker collection, guys, because that's what I'm really excited about. So, so uh, first, we're starting off uh, these Pharrell William NMDs here. Uh, these are from the Inspiration Pack. I got this is probably my second uh, pair of hype shoes that I ever got, and uh, these are actually kind of now my beaters because you can't really see right now, but these shoes have seen better days. But uh, I still keep them uh, and I cherish them. And uh, yeah, this is my first pair of like uh, NMDs because back in the day, if you guys remember, the Fred William NMDs, the red one, green, yellow, and blue, those ones were like scoring for so much money. And I wanted a piece of that, so I got these ones. Second pair of NMDs, guys, are these cream ones. I know the explosion on this camera is going crazy right now, but these are cream uh, Fred William NMDs. Uh, these are probably my second or favorite NMDs. Uh, for all the NMDs, uh, yeah, the color is just superb. So, I got these ones. Uh, okay, guys, third pair. Uh, uh another a pair of uh, for all the NMDs. I know on camera, the explosion on this camera is just doing a lot right now. But basically, I know this looks very similar to the previous one I showed you. But these are a slightly different shade of cream tan color, and uh, these are a nerd collaboration. I guess you can see at the bottom, one side is blue, one side is green. Uh, it's a collab, and I really wanted. I don't know. I feel like I should have bought this shoe. Not gonna lie to you, I'll admit that. But I really wanted a nerd collaboration, so I got these. They look nice, and yeah. Well, this is the last pair of uh, NMDs. Uh, these are from NMDs. I forgot which pack it's on the front, but these are all black ones. I think I'm not sure. Uh, and they come with white laces, but I got the black ones instead. And again, I got these because I love in, uh, for all the NMDs. And uh, again, a black shoe, this is one of the shoes I wear a lot. Even to racetracks, I wear the shoe quite a lot. So again, great shoe, super comfortable. So over here, guys, we got my very first pair of, I would say, so-called hype sneakers that I ever got. And these are both my parents. I think this is one of, if, if this is not the only shoe my parents ever bought, maybe one of the two shoes. My parents are actually one of the two because this one and the black NMDs over there, those are the ones my parents bought me. The rest of the shoes you are seeing I paid for myself. So, this is my first pair of like hype shoes, they didn't really fit me anymore. But these are Adidas 350 Frozen Yellows. Uh, love these things. I wish they still fit me quite nicely, but a little bit snug. I still wear them on occasion, but yeah, guys, my first pair. We'll always keep these. Next pair, uh, you can choose a beat on camera. These are my Adidas Easy 350 Cloud Whites. Uh, funny story about these. I bought these to sell back in 2019 uh, to sell. But the thing is, I don't know why, but I bought them my size. And what happened was they didn't sell. So I was like, oh, oh well, I'll just keep them. So that's why I have these. I didn't really want them, but they're in my. I bought them my size. No one wants them, so I was like, no, I'll just do it. Take a drawing and just keep them. these. Uh, I did it easy to 50 breads. Uh, again, all black, easy. I wanted something to wear every day, and I do these every day. Easy comfort, easy boost technology is superior. If you guys know your shoes, you know that boost is just, it's number one, there's no other way. Uh, my Easy 350 slates, I got these last year. It's almost been years since I bought them and they're still actually dead stock. Gold. I got these, I really like the color and again, boost technology is so comfortable. The Nike Dunk Low Pandas, they use like so dirty right now because I can, it's almost like my beats are with them like so often. I actually need to watch these but yeah pandas they're everywhere i'm not gonna lie next pair are these uh uh, uh night dunk low is the quick purple guys purple is my second favorite color so uh and again i think these are like i really wanted these a big shout out to my friend who imports these from uh, overseas for me 
Uh, I love these things. Probably my favorite pair. Of, these are my favorite pair of dunks that I own. SB dunks. Third pair of, of dunks. We got the Nike Dunk Low uh, uh, Undefeated. Nike Dunk Low Undefeated here, guys. Uh, these are still, still brand new. I haven't worn them yet. First pair of Dream Force that I ever bought. Uh, are these drone 4 Oreos guys? Yo, these things are going for so much money, I really understand. But yeah, an all white pair or almost all white pair of fours. Second pair of fours are the drone 4 lightnings here. Uh these are really cool. I wanted something yellow in my collection, something bright. And uh, yeah, I got these. These are still brand new and worn them yet, but still saving a lot of cane for these. A little side story, my favorite shoe uh, uh, of all time or the other. I'm not saying favorite shoe, but my favorite collection was the Off-White uh, X Nike collaboration uh, from Virgil Abloh. That was my favorite. That was like for me the Ferrari, the Lamborghini, whatever the McLaren of shoes. And I got a few here. I don't get obviously all of them because they're really expensive, but I'm happy to have some of them in my collection. So let's start with those. First pair are uh, my Off-White Prestos. These are beat. Can't even tell on camera, but these things I've seen better days. But I got them for uh, a solid price thanks to homie. So yeah. First pair of these. Um, second pair of off whites are these off white Converse. Uh, I don't have any pair of Converse, so these are my only ones, and it's off white, so can't even say no to that. And again, a white shoe looks good. Third pair of off whites are these off white uh, Blazer Reapers. Uh, these are the black uh, black version. Uh, I didn't expect to buy these, but the price was so good on them that I had to pull the triggers. And yeah, and now we get on to the holy grail in my collection. This is the shoe that made me start reselling and afford this shoe. And I actually made a whole entire video on this shoe on my 18th birthday. Uh, I'm gonna link it down below in the description, guys. My favorite shoe of all time. These are the off-white UNC, guys. Favorite grails. These are like my everything. Most expensive shoe of my collection and the one that took me the longest to get are these right here. Don't wear them a lot, but they mean a lot to me because it kind of represents the hard work I had to put in to business to be able to afford my dream, uh, uh, dream shoe. And now we are a new chapter. We're gonna work hard on YouTube to afford the dream car. I start with these shoes right here. So guys, those are Jordan One High uh, sides and black toes. I don't have them with me right now because at a friend's house. And second pair of shoes are my Jordan One High uh, real toes. Blue is my favorite color. I uh, also forgot to mention about the UNC's blue my favorite color and yeah, so these are probably one of my favorite Jordan 1's that I have My Jordan 1 High Obsidian's these things were so cheap then TikTok made them so expensive But luckily I bought them for the hype because I actually like the colorway of these uh, Obsidian's they have no lace on because I washed them recently, but the next one is something I feel like it's not a classic But just it's really stylish are the Jordan 1 High Rookie of the Year um, Again, I don't wear this shoe a lot because the material on these is super like delicate, but this shoe just looks so beautiful. The other one that I have is a Jordan 1 High Taxi. Uh, this is not really a yellow shoe. It's like it's, a, it's like a mixture between orange and yellow. I got these, they're still brand new. And we still got more shoes. Not done, we're not done just yet. Yeah, like I said, I'm a sneakerhead. I still be buying shoes even though I've got I've a car. So let's start. Hey guys, another pair that I have in the dunk collection are these just yes, the like, exposure. Please do your thing. There we go. I got this pair of all white dunk lows. Uh, I wanted to buy these as an everyday shoe because everybody has all white Air Forces, you know, which I understand. But I want to be different, so I got an all white pair of dunks because you don't see me of these around. So yeah, next pair that I have uh, is this Nike Dunk Low. Sashiko Industrial Blue, which is basically a dunk glow with denim on it. I don't know if you guys can see it. Let the, the camera do this thing. This thing is denim on the white and the blue parts. And it's got really cool touches on, on the toe box and uh, on the back. We've got these Jordan 1. Oh, yo, I said Jordan 1. We've got these Jordan 4 um, Retros. These are the sea foams. Uh, it's a woman's colorway, but I really like it anyway. Is, this is a pair of Jordan 4 uh, Thunders. This is the the 
the other version of the thunders. Let me just get the thunders for you real quick. You guys can see we got the yellow on black and the black on yellow. So I had to get both. Over here, guys, we got the drone one high lucky green. Uh, still brand new. I got this because I need to add more colors to the Jordan 1 collection. I'm trying to get the whole Rainbow Nation on the Jordan. So we got the green now. The only color I need right now is yellow, like yellow, yellow, and green. No, yellow and orange. But orange is expensive. But yeah, that's the last few of my collection, guys. But yeah guys, that's it is my entire sneaker collection guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I try to make it as short as possible so I don't make this video too long for you guys. And I want you guys to let me down down below in the comments what shoe was your favorite out of all the ones that I have. And also, are there any other shoes that you guys would like to see me add to my collection guys? Let me know down below in the comments. If you guys ever want shoes like that or want to buy specific shoes that I already that I do have, make sure to do it guys with so reserve. Support the business, support the uh, uh, the car build by supporting me guys and the business so link will be down below in the description so reserve remember guys uh, use the code natty28 to get 10% off all your orders on the website uh, and yeah guys and also a reminder that my business expo with sneaker stand will be at bragging rights on the 27th this coming weekend at rest our raceway and I hope to guys see you there guys and yeah just a little uh, insight as to how I make my money uh, and what is paying for all the stuff you guys see on my car and as well as these shoes really and other stuff so guys if you guys enjoyed this video please make sure to like and subscribe and uh, also a little side note if you guys do want to see some more new content on the channel like I did back in the OG days let me know that again down below in the comments and with that guys I hope you guys enjoyed it's your boy Lati signing out